this is a problem. It's not a problem. You alienated part of America. I alienated crazy people. You couldn't resist, could you? Jesus, not you two. This is a problem. I keep trying to explain that, but the president won't listen. Poverty is a problem. Apartheid is a problem. This, this is just a couple of... Here's the latest approval ball. We lost 20 points. We can get them back. They're at 20 points. I'll admit that's a little lower than anticipated. So you agree you have a problem? No, you do. You're the communications director. Fix this. Can you give me 100% employment? No. Will you give me Fuck no. Then I'm in trouble. King, can you have this nice say assassinated? Not when you say it publicly. You're my fun as a gang leader. We have a country to run. Fun isn't part of the equation. Where's a septic truck when you need one? Maybe Keith has a good word for me. I'm really not looking forward to question time. Listen, we've got enough clout right now for one major bill, not both. What do you want me to push forward? Do you want to be the president who cured cancer or the president who solved world hunger? Cancer can kiss my ass. Good choice. Hope Kinsey's got the press under control. Now, you listen here. If you think you can cram your agenda past Congress, you are in for a rude awakening. You hear me? Now, let me tell you a little something about the greatest word in politics. Filibuster. Allow me to retort. Oi, Doris, we're still on for tennis, yes? Oleg and I are about to head over to Camp David to watch some Nightblade. Yep. You down? Boom! Hell yeah, I'm in. I'm your number one fan! Nice work, Oleg. words were taken out of context. Kinsey, what's the right context for, and I quote, I'm the patron saint of America. We should probably look into changing the Pledge of Allegiance to one nation under me. That's a great question. Jane? I think we have a problem. Uh, not you two. How many times do I have Asha to... Asha and Miller are waiting for you in the Oval Office. If MI6 needed something, they would send it up the chain, not fly across an ocean. They said nobody back home believes them. Jesus, what's going on? They think we're about to be attacked by aliens. I gotta go. This is serious. You know that Kinsey's been saying the same thing. When did you start taking Kinsey seriously? When the people who helped us save the world said we should. All right. I'll swing by after I... <laughs> and brightest among you will find salvation within the Zin Empire. I'm smarter than all these people. Delightful. Kitty, no! Protect the president! I do love your spirit, my dear. I'm Zinyak. Pleasure to meet you. Would you like to join me for a ride? You're all right. You all right? 
Where's Matt? Upstairs, trying to find out what's happening. What is happening? All her war, by the looks of it. I'm meeting up with Matt. I'll be in touch via comm. Stay safe. It's the bleeding arsenal of democracy. Oh, lovely, lovely guns. It's comp- Safe now, eh? Come on, this way! What the fuck, Keith? God damn it! You are there. Bertuoni. Bertuoni. Activate South Portico defenses. Well, let's do this, you beautiful, deadly thing. Go on, chuck on this. I'll prank every last one of you. Nick, my mates. Cabinet. You think you can come here and bollocks my country? Work better than I This is for Lady Liberty. This one's for Uncle Sam. And this one's just for shits and giggles. Enjoy leaping so much. Get off my lawn, you son of a bitch! Didn't count on me, did you? 
Well, hello there. Welcome aboard. Gonna mount you over the fireplace, you idiot fuck! Now, now. Not so far. Glorious day. Holy oh, to the Saints! Brought to you by Friendly Fryer, the only choice in home cookware. Friendly Fryer. Morning, dear. I made your favorite breakfast. Oh, Mr. King from across the street is going out of town for a few weeks. He was wondering if you could check his mail for him. Oh, and your friend Pierce called. I'm sure he has some crazy new get-rich scheme. Oh, that Pierce. Such a card. And someone named Dex stopped by earlier. I didn't recognize him, so I just sent him away. I think I heard Timmy deliver the paper earlier. Could you fetch it, dear? Right away, dear. I did a eye, neighbor. I wonder what is going on in the world today. <laughs> you ready to meet the fine people of Steelport? Well, <laughs> get in the car. Don't I usually drive? It's your world. Go ahead. They sure are anxious to meet you. And by they, you mean? <laughs> well, you do have a queer sense of humor. Why does this all look so bizarre? Now, what's that you say? Something's not right. This is so odd. Can't wait to get out to the lake this weekend. I hear the fish are really biting. Poor fish. What are you talking about? Don't you worry now. We're almost there. Oh, careful now. Here we are. Why don't you glad hand a bit? We got time. Ow! My toe! <laughs> Can I get a picture? Aw, thank you kindly. Looks like it's time. Your public is waiting. Oh, my stars, it's the president! Hi, how a. What a. 
We don't use that kind of language here in Steelport. free from the place you're in isn't real whatever it's having you do you need to stop but i'm driving a car okay good there's a park nearby head there and give me a sec let's pump it now Brace yourself. Brace for good God! I need some more time before I can get you out. It would be really helpful if you could just, you know, just be you. Who else would I be? The simulation is all about normalcy. Pleasantry, order, all the things you need. Go forth. Unleash hell. Sure is neato. You're doing great. The simulation is. Oh no. Wait a minute. What am I waiting for, Kinsey? What's wrong? Couldn't leave well enough alone, could you? You had to push and push and push. I hope you've enjoyed your last moments. Whooping. 
I'm impressed. Where the hell are... Oh, fuck me. I should have realized a prison of peace would never hold a sociopath like yourself. I'm more of a puckish rogue. A rose by any other name. Are you trying to kill me or sleep with me? Charming. See, there you go with those mixed messages again. Then allow me to be perfectly clear. I am the architect of your reality. I build what I want. I destroy what I want. And your bravado means... There's nowhere to run. You belong to me. Now, on to more pleasant things. I'm going to place you in your new home. Try to run again, and I'll destroy your pitiful planet. Did you hear that? My friends... Each of you are guilty of crimes against the Zin Empire. But today is your lucky day. Today, you get to be a part of a new work release program. Swear your fealty, and I will empower you to be Wardens of Simulation 31. You will have one purpose. Torment the President of the United States. Beyond that, the world is yours to toy with. Ravage it. Indulge in your basest desire. It makes no difference to me. Just leave the prisoner alive. I want them broken. Not dead. Go now and tear their world asunder. Where am I? Come in, President. Can you hear me? Yes, love. But uh, how? Since I don't have my mobile with me. I just patched myself into your simulation and projected my voice through the audio system. You should be able to hear me from anywhere. And you don't have to yell. Right, because I love voices in my head. Kinsey, I'm unarmed here. Kindly show me the exit. I can't do that until I backtrace your signal to your physical body. Until then, you're stuck there. So you might want to go buy a gun. Brilliant. So I'm up to friendly fire. <laughs> 